You can actually like peel it off to be honest. We have trust in this, we have hope in this, and this car will start up. Check it out man, what an old school car this is. Whoa! Come on, come on, let's go! guys welcome to another video with Hoodstig yes this is abandoned the car that's been left here to rot but I just give it a bit of an insight I actually don't know exactly the specs I just do know that it's a Volvo um, it's a Volvo 480 ES um, it's a four cylinder it's a 1.7 litre I'm trying to start this car and the next video will be cleaning the car see if, we can see if this car can be in a, in a saleable state but let's pop the hood to start off with here these old cars are very heavy this bonnet is wow okay yeah so this car doesn't start we've just fitted a new battery um let's talk about the outside of the car how the car looks it's you can tell it's been here for so many years look at all them all these moss put the gloves on again <laughs> Sherlock Holmes take this off all these problems, the car's been sitting for a long time, you can tell from the brakes. You know, it's got a fair amount of rust. You can actually like peel it off to be honest. It's literally on its on its way out this is. But um we have trust in this, we have hope in this, and this car will start up. Check it out man, what an old school car this is. You'll never see one of these back in the days. But um, yeah, but this is probably someone's granddad's car. This is so uh, let's let's take get into the car. Look at these. Look at that for an interior. Looks so sick. Look at the back. Look at that glove compartment in the back. That is so amazing. Uh, let's have a sit inside. Wow, this thing's got a clock. It's got um, battery power. Oil. It's got. Um, miles per hour, 140 miles per hour, not bad, 6,000 revs it's got, I've never ever actually been in a Volvo before, this is my first Volvo so yeah, nice cut on, 5 speed but uh, yeah, look at the sofa, look at the cobweb there the spider's probably going, oh my god, it's got a sunroof as well a manual sunroof, like the old days wow, this is so old school I quite like how this car looks to be honest if anybody has any information about these cars, drop a comment down below. I'd really appreciate it. And if anybody's actually interested in this car, like give me a shout out. This car is going to go up for sale soon when we get this back onto the road. So if anybody wants first dibs, drop a comment down below. Anybody that wants to buy this car and restore this car, just give me a shout. That looks pretty bad to be honest. Pretty thin. People might say it's a rust bucket, but you just never know sometimes. You just never know. This is the UK at the end of the day. Um, I checked the fuel, uh, the fuel pump underneath the car. Um, I've checked the the crank, a spanner, and the, the crank spin. So I know the the pistons will be okay. But I can't think of another reason to why the car won't start. But what we're going to do, like I said, we're going to jump start the car and see if the car even turns. Okay, micro power. Okay, it's sparking, it's sparking. Savage Rebels UK, I've been watching their videos and they're quite helpful in uh, knowing how to start old cars. I'll even have the door open a bit so we can hear it. Wow, this door opens so wide, but it just keeps on shutting. I'm gonna do it one handed. Alright, Bismillah. All the lights are going up. Start it. Come on, come on, come on. Let's go. <laughs> Okay. Okay, it's not starting up. The horn is even going off. One more time. Yeah, it's not starting up. It says fuel there. So whether the car's got no fuel left, what we're gonna do is spray, 
some uh, fl flammable spray in the engine intake and see if that helps but at the moment it's cranking she's cranking all right so we're gonna take this out so what we're gonna do is we're gonna open this up from the inlet plenum and then once we do that maybe then we can um, spray some fireball spray and see if the car starts If you guys can see that, we're gonna spray inside here. Normally, um, you try easy start, but at this present moment of time, I don't have an easy start. I've actually got some, uh, so we're gonna try that. It's flammable, so it should work. So, whenever you're ready, oh, whoa. Wow! Do that again, do that again, do that again! Do that again, do that again! Whoa! I think there's no fuel in the car there's no fuel in the car so at least it starts up it starts up and that's the most important thing so we'll get some petrol but happy days the car starts up petrol now unleaded and we're gonna put it in get the car to drink a bit now shake it Go, 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 come on. Yes, come on. That's how you do it. Yes, come on. Alhamdulillah, we did it. Woo. Bit of throttle. Do a bit of throttle, let the induction here. So we'll let her run for a while. Call that cobwebs. So far so good. She's running well. We'll let her run for a while, see how she is, but check the engine oil. I've uh, chopped up the water and she's running well so far. See how she is for a couple of minutes and we'll get back to it again. Okay, so we'll add the car to run for about five, 10 minutes and she's running fine. Do a bit of gas. She's running really well. Electric windows. So we're gonna give her a spin in the block. See how she drives. First gear, let's go. Wow, quite a lot of power there. Bit of gas, cause I don't wanna Stole it. <laughs> We're driving. We're driving, we are. Car drives absolutely fine right now. I'm not trying to drive the car crazy, but yeah. <laughs> Woohoo! Yeah! Car is driving foul. Look at those seats in here. I feel like I'm born in the 80s. <laughs> oh gosh.
don't know how to do this, but reverse. Do a bit of burnout to celebrate the complimentary uh, start up. <laughs> All right. Running so good so far. Very well. We did it though. She's running well. Performing well. Bit of bush here. Take them out. But we did it in the end. There's not a better feeling then getting a car started up after it's been sat for a number of years we've got her running let's bring the old schools back to life but that's it really so again really appreciate everybody dropping a comment down below best things upon each and every one of you and peace take care